Here we have the bottle fill station, which is located on a floor. Usually this is going to be where we're setting up our rehab area and where we're going to set up our staging area. So he's going to come in and prepare the system for the two bottles that he's going to charge here. And he's going to pick up the bottles from the staging area and he hooks up his two bottles. This will probably not be a firefighter in full uniform. It'll be somebody uh, in his full bunkers. It'll be somebody doing this job to get the bottles and hook up different bottles and fill them from this. And again, this is going to be in our staging rehab area where he's going to be able to use the cabinet to fill it. And this is one of the areas that the command system is going to want to look at to make sure they pick an area that has this uh, capability when they are figuring out their areas for their uh, rehab and staging. And he hooks up his two bottles, make sure the cylinders are open. Once it's all set, he's going to rotate them in. And again, that's the protection feature of the system. He's going to lock the system and then he's going to fill the systems. And he's going to make sure that he's bringing this, the bottles up to the pressure that they want on the system that they have and the bottles that the department uses. So as the first set of bottles are inside filling, he's putting two more bottles in place. So this is a system where we can rotate and keep going, okay? And we have another bottle that he can hook up and he will hook up both bottles and he will be able to hook them up, get them in place and be ready. Even if it takes, if the bottles on the other side are already filled, that's okay because what he's doing is hooking these two bottles up and getting them ready to rotate in. So we can keep using this system and keep making headway here. Okay, he's gonna have to shut the bleeder and open up both cylinders, okay? And once he opens that up, he's gonna release the lock on the other side, rotate the system in, close the handle, and you can hear the bottles there starting to fill. Now he will take the other ones, close the cylinders all the way, and then bleed it down, and then they'll be ready to go back in use. And again, this is depending on your department's policy, how many bottles your people are allowed to go through before they have to go down to rehab and clear your rehab standard. 